Last season, Arizona Coyotes forward Anthony Duclair posted 20 goals and 24 assists. This year's been a different story, where Duclair registered just three goals and seven assists through the end of January, which resulted in the left wing's demotion to the Tucson Roadrunners. Obviously, it was a tough stretch there for uh, for myself, but at the same time, uh, you know, since I've been back, I've been working hard and just uh, keeping a positive attitude. Coyotes general manager John Chaika said the reason for the demotion was to help Duclair regain his scoring touch. After a two-month stint in Tucson, Duclair returned to Phoenix at the start of March. In April, he's notched two goals. Well, obviously, staying out there a little more, uh, just uh, working on a, a few skill things. Uh, you know, obviously, can improve your game, and uh, I'm, off, I'm an offensive player, so uh, you know, for myself, if uh, the puck's not going in, I gotta do other things to, to help the team win. So, uh, I want to be able to do that. Duclair's return to the Coyotes signals the reunion of the Killer D's, dating back to their days on Canada's World Junior Hockey Championship team. Anthony Duclair and Max Domi make up part of the foundation of promising young talent on the roster. One of your close buddies comes back. And um, like I said, it's it's not just on the ice; it's off the ice. And, and his attitude towards all of our um, success is, is big too. And he's such a big part of this team, and he will be for a long time. Domi said the team's happy to have Duclair back because he's a big piece to the group, both on and off the ice. He, he is who he is. He's an unbelievable hockey player. You're never gonna be able to change that. The Coyotes took their time reintroducing Duclair to the lineup, but now he's back to average ice time and has amassed two goals and four assists. In Phoenix, I'm Casey Demarest, Cronkite News.